Well, welcome to the Startup Espresso. I'm Hall T. Martin, the host of the show, where we talk about raising funding for your startup and the time it takes to have an espresso. I hope you enjoy this episode. Hello, this is Hall T. Martin with the Startup Funding Espresso, your daily shot of startup funding and investing. In raising funding over the life of the startup, you'll find there are differences in the fundraise at each stage. The goal at the seed stage is to show you can sell the product. At this stage, the investors will look primarily at the team since there's little in the way of product or revenue. You need to show a working prototype and initial customer validation, though. You must convince the investor that customers will pay for the product and use it. At the Series A stage, the goal is to show you can grow the business. At this stage, you need to show a repeatable, predictable process for acquiring the customer, delivering the service, and retaining them. Show a sales funnel with prospects tracking through the process turning into customers. At the Series B stage, the goal is to show you can scale the business. In this stage, you need to show you have growth drivers built into the business that scales the company. This includes systems that can drive scale growth, such as a partner network, Salesforce capability, and ability to expand into new markets with the same platform. At each stage, the pitch deck will need to reflect the goal for the fundraise and demonstrate what the business is doing to achieve it. Thank you for joining us for the Startup Funding Espresso, where we help startups and investors connect for funding. Let's go start us into today. Paul T. Martin is the director of Investor Connect, which is a 501c3 nonprofit dedicated to the education of investors for early stage funding. All opinions expressed by Hall and podcast guests are solely their own opinions and do not reflect the opinion of Investor Connect. This podcast is for informational purposes only and should not be relied upon as a basis for investment decisions.